English, Español, Vanus Enigma. Innocent Crypto Kitty. 16-04-21. This last night I didn't sleep almost the whole night, just in the morning, maybe from 8 till 10, I slept a little. Esta última noche casi no he dormido nada, um, solo casi um, desde las 8 hasta las 10 por la mañana, un poco, dos horas. Remember my last video was number 138, video mix with the title love your neighbor as yourself transgender psychology um health care um bitcoin flat earth diagnosis recuerda mi último video era el video mix numero 138 8 si sí, 8 3 138 y el título era ama tu vecino como a ti mismo um, y ay, debería crear esta cuenta de twitter en español copiar todos estos vídeos los títulos están en, en inglés y debería copiarlos al español Sorry, uh, ok. Uh, ama tu vecino a ti mismo, um, psicología, uh, transgénero, y, uh, seguro social, uh, seguro médico, uh, tierra plana y bitcoin, gnosis, era el título del vídeo. Actually, when I started that video, I wanted to create, I wanted to talk especially about that, uh, that video that inspired me to create a community of single people, uh, the aim like uh, to create a neighborhood, bungalows. Bueno, al principio, cuando empecé este video, uh, era más bien, me inspiró, estaba escuchando ahí ese video, luego me inspiró de, uh, creo que voy a empezar a abrir otra cuenta de Twitter, um, de abrir una comunidad de personas que son cinco viviendo solo la meta este eh, hacer un complejo de bungalows o algo así vecinos vivir juntos gente que le gusta la vida así de vivir solito pero <risa> con buenos vecinos <risa> As the Bible says, love your neighbor as yourself. It's very difficult to sometimes to live. love your neighbors. Como dice la Biblia, ama tu mismo, a tu, tu vecino como a ti mismo. A veces muy difícil de amar a tu vecino. But then um, I met the walking outside going shopping I met the transgender person for the first time we talked a lot and got a little distracted that was the last video bueno luego quise si sí, seguir grabando este tema pero luego ahí caminando hacia eh, mis compras creando videos um, me encontré con esa persona transgénito transgen sí 
Bueno, en español más bien se usa la palabra transexual, aunque ella eh, prefiere usar, eh, sí, se habla de mismo, mismo, sí misma de mujer y usa un nombre de mujer en Facebook. Several years before, I uh, watched many videos about the topic uh, transgender and intersex. Uh, and anyway, when I was young, I was always uh, feeling like a boy till the age of about 12 when I got anorexia. Bueno, ya también hace unos años también miré muchos vídeos sobre el tema de transgénero y uh, queer, también se dice um, gender queer, y también quise decir uh, también cuando era niña pequeña, um, era como un niño jugando en coches, playing with cars, instead of dolls, en coches a lugar de muñecas, y hasta la edad de más o menos 12 años, luego caí en una anorexia bastante fuerte y peligrosa, dangerous, anorexia was really almost dying, I was very thin. Okay, on when I had uploaded that video number 138, cuando es, uh, había terminado de subir ese video número 138. Okay, normally I focus very much on cryptocurrency, Bitcoin and flat earth. Uh, Normalmente me concentro mucho en ese tema de criptomoneda, Bitcoin y tierra plana. But then, uh, often or sometimes I <laughs> watch different uh, topics too. But anyway, I don't have TV, so I watch uh, just uh, YouTube. Uh, de todas formas, no tengo televisión, miro solo YouTube. So then I watched many videos about this transgender topic and queer. Luego miré muchos videos sobre ese tema de transexual o transgénero, como quieras llamarlo, y también de la, el nombre a queer. Y luego... And then I got to know that alphabet soup of FTM, abbreviation for female to male. Luego fui aprendiendo sobre eh, la sopa de alfabeto de FTM, que es abbreviation por uh, femenino uh, F2 masculino and about testosterone there are two different treatments um, injection and uh, a body cream of testosterone hay dos tratamientos diferentes de testosterona de um, inyección en el cuerpo y también uh, crema corporal. Uh, the most interesting, uh, I found that many FTM people told that they lost their period, menstruation, blood, 
lo más interesante era que um, esa gente FTM uh, luego uh, cuando tomaron ese testosterón se le paró el periodo menstruación sangre <risa> vampiro <risa> If I remember well, um, uh, between one or two months, after one or two months of treatment of testosterone, I'm not sure, ma more or less, más o menos, creo, entre uno y dos meses después de tomar ese tratamiento de testosterone. In several accounts, I am using profile picture of cat. In various cuentas internet, estoy usando eh, la imagen de perfil del gato. And I can imagine, like, <laughs> when I hear about that, stopping the period with the, the testosterone treatment, it goes like the ears of the cat go like, cling, go up, <laughs> like, oh, this is interesting. <laughs> Y puedo así uh, imaginar la uh, imagen del gato cuando oye que con ese tratamiento de testosterón se le para el periodo y, 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 y las orejas del gato hacen clic hacia arriba. Oye, oh, yeah, yeah, eso es interesante. <laughs> Because honestly, although I'm not... Uh, in any relationship, having sex, I'm taking the pill now over 20 years and I'm really tired of always remembering taking that fucking pill, anti-baby pill. Aunque yo no tengo relación o tener sexo. Eh, a pesar, igualmente estoy tomando esta píldora anti bebé porque no quiero por algún accidente quedarme embarazada. I really don't want to get pregnant. I was always very uh, sure I don't want to have children and now even more. Uh, that I, uh, these last three years since 2012, what's going on in the world, satanic uh, leadership, Illuminati, and so on, how much television lies. Television. I mentioned before that at the age of, of about 12, I got one um, very dangerous anorexia and um, to the age of about 18, I still didn't have my period of menstruation. Antes mencioné que a la edad de 12 años, algo así, Cogí una anorexia bastante peligrosa y no tuve ningún periodo hasta la edad de 18 o algo así. Luego, and then they told me to take one, some medicine, but I don't know, rem I don't remember exactly. My mother told me. Uh, that I refused to take that medicine. Uh, but then later, I think at the age of 18, uh, my period started automatically, naturally. Sí, antes mencioné que a uh, edad de 12 años conseguí esa, esa anorexia bastante peligrosa hasta la, los 18. No tuve el periodo de menstruación. 
luego no recuerdo exactamente pero mi madre dice que debería haber me dijeron de tomar una medicina para acelerar ese proceso pero uh, yo no quise pero luego parece que naturalmente vino el periodo over the last years I before I took almost always the uh, 35 just these last I think two or three years I took one month Diana uh, 35 and then one month overplex and uh, then again well, Diana uh, 35 and so on <laughs> los últimos años he cambiado entre Diana 35 y overplex o un mes y otro mes variando um, just a last summer um, two times I forgot to take the pill I took it later uh, and when it was the second time I said oh now it's the second time I'm I'm almost like 12 or more hours late so maybe I'll take a break anyway I'm not in a relationship I don't have sex so okay I made that mistake now I'll make a break último verano um, is uh, dos veces se me olvidó de tomar la píldora cuando era la segunda vez. Dije, mira, ya es la segunda vez. Ahora, de toda forma, no tienes relación, no tienes sexo. Vamos a hacer una pausa. If I remember well, it was like two periods. I had like two months then without and it was really painful and just when I was learning about flat earth I was feeling like dying I had this painful period menstruation and then I started to take again um, the other uh, 35 or over overplex last year Uh, October, November. Sí, luego tuve estos como dos meses de pausa, pero luego tuve unas menstruaciones bastante dolorosas y justo ese tiempo, octubre, estuve aprendiendo sobre el tema de tierra plana y me sentí como estar muriendo. Y luego volví a empezar a tomar la píldora. At the moment, I'm almost in the middle of the month. And I think I, the last pill I'm going to take on 2nd of May. De momento estoy más o menos en el, um, casi en la mitad del mes y la última píldora voy a tomar el segundo de mayo 2016. Remember that uh, bad pagan tradition of first of May, so I better stay at home. Recuerda esta tradición del primero de mayo, una tradición pagana bastante mala. Before I continue to talk about what I am planning to do in the future, 
Antes de que voy a seguir hablando sobre lo que pienso hacer el futuro, en el futuro, I want to explain that I care much more about what God thinks about me than what people think about me. Quiero explicar que me preocupa mucho más de lo que Dios piensa sobre mí que en comparación de que la gente piensa sobre mí. I know that in the Old Testament, Leviticus are written many, many commandments like uh, about this homosexual and lesbian stuff. And you know, but not just that, you may not pe eat pork, uh, women may not talk in the church, uh, many things. In the Antiguo Testamento de la Biblia, Leviticus, están escrito muchos mandamientos de sobre cuántas cosas no se debería hacer el tema por supuesto de la homosexualidad eh, y también de no comer puerco los shrimps a la, como las mujeres no deben hablar en las iglesias y muchas cosas más Ah, especialmente que si una mujer se queda embarazada sin esposo que la gente tiene derecho de apedrearla la mujer matarlas joder increíble sorry I was so confused I said first in Spanish that uh, the if a woman gets pregnant without husband then they have the right to kill uh, to stone that woman and all that stuff incredible the Torah Old Testament but anyway I uh, believe in the gospel of Jesus Christ or uh, maybe better to call him Yeshua. It's more probable that name. Just uh, made a little video in the, my second YouTube channel of short videos on this enigma about that topic. Pero de todas formas creo en el gospel en del Nuevo Testamento Jesucristo y es mucho más probable que se llamó Yeshua eh, hace poco también hizo un pequeño slideshow en mi nuevo canal de YouTube Short Videos Vanos Nima and what I wanted to explain especially is there's a diff big difference between gender identity and sexual orientation. Lo que quise explicar especialmente es que hay una gran diferencia entre um, identidad de género y orientación sexual with respect to the topic of sexual orientation I want to repeat again uh, that idea I <sighs> 
going to create a community of single people and uh, my dream is to live in a neighborhood like bungalows uh, which are all single people con respeto al tema de la orientación sexual quiero repetir que pienso abrir una comunidad, comunidad de personas que son singles, que viven, que les gusta vivir solos o solas. I've got a very long to-do list and um, spending <laughs> Time making love is very low on the to-do list. Although I sometimes I uh, <laughs> I just want to get an orgasm fast, <laughs> just to relax, and I can perfectly do that by myself. Actually, better because later I want to sleep. I don't want people to disturb me. <laughs> Tengo una lista de tareas muy larga y pasar ahí. De toda forma no uh, siento atracción sexual. Simplemente quiero a veces para poder dormir, relajarme. Quiero sacarme rápidamente un orgasmo y lo puedo hacer. Perfectamente, perfect, <laughs> perfectamente sola, solo, sola, <laughs> suena raro, anyway, okay, I admit sometimes I feel a little lonely, but, bueno, admito que a veces me siento un poco solita, pero, I think this problem would be solved in the best way in living in a community of single people. I like to talk on the street, maybe go to the beach together. Just friendship. Creo que la mejor manera de solucionar ese problema sería de estar viviendo así en una comunidad de también todas personas que les gusta vivir solos, tal vez ir a la playa juntos, amistad, o share that swimming pool normally, y en Gran Canaria hay muchos complejos de, con bungalows que comparten una piscina, un swimming pool. Sorry, I mix English with Spanish. That they share uh, the swimming pool together. Aquí en Gran Canaria hay muchos bungalows que comparten uh, la piscina juntos. Ya me preguntaba antes um, oh, sorry, first in English. <laughs> I asked myself before, um, in average, how many bungalows are in one complex? In average, I think minimum 10 and I think a maximum 100. I'm not sure, but I'm just... Uh, was just some days ago, even I was thinking about that. Ya me preguntaba antes, um, ¿cuántos bungalows en la media calculando, comparando los complejos de bungalows? Normalmente mínimo 10 y creo que máximo como 100. Actually, on the top of my to-do list 
is um, to open a new Twitter account um, with um, uh, like the name community of single people uh, let's see one username to reserve uh, that <laughs> username <laughs> Justo arriba en mi lista de tareas por hacer. De momento quiero... Bueno, ya hace dos días o tres que tengo pensado de abrir una nueva cuenta de Twitter. Uh, así la comunidad de uh, para uh, personas que les gusta vivir solos. Single. Sure. It was like it was not by any standards a good picture, uh, and, and it wasn't indicative, indicative of our space program. But more importantly, why did you wait so long? I used the um, I, I came up with an analogy recently, and I call it the angry wife syndrome. And you'll kind of see where I'm going with this. And that is uh, a wife is you know husband and wife are married for 40 years. Husband comes home, the wife says, "Hey, I'm divorcing you," and she and he goes, "Why?" And he goes, she goes, well, it's because after 40 years, you've only given me one bouquet of flowers, right? And so what happens the very next day? He, uh, he comes back with a bouquet of flowers, right? And, and he goes, well, now you don't have to, you know, now we, we don't have to get a divorce. Well, you know how the rest of that plays out. She goes, well, what are you talking about? Women know better. It's like, what are you talking about? It, you bring me flowers now? After 40 years, the only reason you brought it is because I because I mentioned it in conversation. That is what the fo the photograph was like, which was 43 years, not a single you know a photograph of Earth, and then all of a sudden in July of 2015, they're going, oh, NASA just says, oh yeah, by the way, here's a photograph of the Earth, second blue marble shot we taken in 43 years. Obama comes on does a little press conference about it. Neil deGrasse Tyson tweets it. it NASA tweets it, and it's like. Now, now you're bringing it up after we've been harping on you for the last six months that you don't have a picture of the, you know, the Earth from space. What happened all the times before? Now, uh, it doesn't, it doesn't count. I, I, I'll, I'll use the angry wife uh, scenario every time if a scientist tries to pin me on it. Anyway, sorry, that's my rant. So no, the, the, the even that one picture from 1972, utter. Utter fake. Uh, look at all the other stuff that's not there from the Americans that should be there. Um, there is no video. Even today, there is no video of the Earth spinning on its axis from space. Not with the weather morphing. Uh, there is no video of any object leaving orbit or returning into Earth's orbit with the camera running. There is no, uh, there is no shot of any astronaut in any mission turning around, doing 180 degrees or better, pan around exterior shot with the camera running. Um, there's not even a shot interior from an airlock where, you, you know, we've all seen it in science fiction movies where the astronaut's getting ready to do a spacewalk and the door opens from the airlock. There's not even a shot from inside of there. There's, there's such an absence of evidence. It drove me insane when I was, when I was looking into this. And, and that's where we are now. It's, it, we all, but, it, but I will give this for NASA. It's clever because there's been so many movies and television shows kind of showing different little spacey things that we've assumed it's always been there, that all the footage has already always been there. But it, whenever it gets to the money shot, if, whenever it gets to the, to, the, to the crux of the scene, they always cut away or do a computer animation or something.